Hello everybody, how are you doing? My name is Badali and this video is about the select into alternative. Okay, the select into is an operator, okay, so but uh, unfortunately this is not supported in the MySQL, so we have to look for an alternative way and I'll be showing you the alternative way of doing the same thing that the select into you know operator does okay but first of all let me just inform you then what is the function of the select into operator okay the select into operator it what it does it, it just copy all of your data from one table to the new table okay so it automatically you know create a new table for you with all those uh, column that you have written there okay specifically or all columns it depends on your need so let me just show you how this thing work we can't use the select into operator so there is an alternative way of achieving the same result of select into so all we need to do is to write create table okay now you have to give a name to the table so i want to give it a name to the countries okay so okay now you have to write the select and now you have to pick the column that you want to have in your new table all right so i want to have all the columns that are available in my country table okay which is here this is your country table okay we have used a lot of the country table here but uh, so what this will be doing this will be doing the same work of the select into operator it will copy all the data okay and create a new table which is countries all right so let me just run this code and see how the things work country is created now let me just see how this work select countries run this QE and now you can see we have all the data that were available on our country table now we have the same data on our new table which is countries all right so uh, this is how you uh, you can select or copy all the data or all the columns from a table but what if you want to select the specific or you know the selective column so all you need to do is to write uh, now i just want to use the name and uh, continent and region you know the columns from the country table and uh, what we want to write here is countries so let's see how does it work okay so we have created the countries to table so let me just show you the countries to table all right this to table okay so okay now you can see here in the countries to table that we are only having those columns that we have written here so this is how you can selectively pick the columns and what if i want to give a condition here okay there is a scenario here that i want to have a table that have the countries but only those countries that belong to the europe so how am i going to do this uh, we will do this in the same way so let me just you know show you how does it work let me just change the name I only want a Europe countries, so Europe countries. All right, select name, continent, region. Okay, that will work fine. Now I have to give it a condition here, which is pair the continent is equal to Europe. Okay, we have created the table. Now let me just show you the Europe countries table from Europe countries all right now you can see here that we are only having those countries in the new table which belongs to the europe okay so this is how select into alternative works you know we have to create the table and all this thing and uh, it just saves a lot of your time and uh, when you just want to copy all the data from one table so okay so this is how things are done here and if you really find this video useful hit the like button and subscribe the channel and bye bye